Are you there, Charlie Bear? Charlie? Oh, will you help me call him? Ready? Are you there, Charlie Bear? There you are, Charlie. Oh, that bag of shopping looks very heavy. Can you manage? <laughs> Charlie, you're being silly now. I know you are. Be careful or else you might drop them. <laughs> oh, Charlie, you'll have to pick all the food up now. Ah, oh, that does sound great, doesn't it? It's wonderful you're making music, Charlie, but I, I don't think you should be using food like that. Charlie? Charlie? Charlie! Food isn't for playing music with, it's for eating. If you want to make music, then use something else. But please, not food. Thank you. Oh, dear. I didn't say that you can't make music. Charlie, what are you doing with that carrot? <laughs> You look like you're conducting an orchestra. Charlie, you are conducting an orchestra, on stage and everything. Fantastic! <laughs> but where's the orchestra you'll be conducting, Charlie? That's your orchestra? You're going to conduct fruit and vegetables? Charlie. It sounds brilliant. Bravo! Sorry. Fruit has gone quiet. Huh? That sounded like a frog. How can a kiwi fruit sound like a frog? Sounds lovely, Charlie. That watermelon just clucked like a chicken. And the carrot mooed like a cow. And the apple just neighed like a horse. is going to sound like... <laughs> oh, oh, dear. It went... <laughs> oh, my, oh, my. <laughs> oh, Charlie, I'm so sorry for laughing, but... <laughs> no, Charlie, stop, please. Food making funny noises is funny, though, isn't it? Just look and listen. 
and the audience think it's funny too. They love it. Ah, oh, that's more like it. Now go and take a bow, John. Food may not be great for making music, but it can be very, very funny. It's amazing what you can do with your imagination. Oh, well done, Charlie. You're taking all the food to the kitchen where it belongs. And you found another way to make music. That's better, uh, I think. <laughs> bye bye, little Charlie Bear. Bye bye, everybody. Are you there, Charlie Bear? Charlie? Will you help me call him? Are you there, Charlie Bear? Oh! There you are, Charlie. What have you been looking for? You've been looking for your camera? Do you mean that camera, Charlie? <laughs> So what are you going to take a photo of then, Charlie Bear? Hey! I wasn't ready. That's not even my best side. What else do you want to take a photo of? Apart from me, that is. You don't know? <laughs> there must be something interesting enough to take a photo of. Not even Frozo. Oh, are you not going to take a photo after all? Are you going to the beach instead? You've come to the beach to take a photo. Oh, there will be all sorts of lovely things to photograph here. Pretty shell. Paw prints in the sand. What are you going to photograph next, Charlie Bear? sculpture. That will make a great photograph. It's Frozo! Oh, you don't want Frozo in your photo, Charlie. He's not going to move, Charlie. He just thinks you're waving to him. There are lots of other amazing things to take pictures of. It's Frozo again! <laughs> now that would be a funny photograph. A seagull and Frozo in the sky with a beach ball. Oh, well, I think it would be a funny photograph. Ah, yes, a photo of the sea. The beautiful, big, empty sea. Frozo won't be in there, will he? He is in there! Oh, dear. Wait, Charlie, where are you going? Wow, Frozo is fast. There 
must be some way you can take a photo without Frozo getting in the way. took a photo of Frozo, made him happy, and now he is going. And now you can take whatever photograph you like without Frozo. <laughs> Are you laughing at the photos you took before? <laughs> oh, look at them brilliant, Charlie. I think Frozo would like those too. <laughs> oh, that's nice. It's amazing what you can do with your imagination. Wow, that's a great background you've drawn for your photo, Charlie Bear. Oh, I love this photo of you both. Bye-bye, <laughs> little Charlie Bear. Bye-bye, everyone. Are you there, Charlie Bear? Where is he? Will you help me call him? Ready? Are you there, Charlie Bear? Oh, there you are, Charlie. Oh, is Rivet going to ski down that slope? Oh, never mind. Try again, Charlie. <laughs> oh, dear. Go on, Charlie. Rivet might make it all the way down this time. What's that, Charlie? Rivet should watch you. <laughs> You're not going to slide down on your feet, are you? Well, it is a little bit harder on skis. Yes, Charlie. I'm sure Rivet's got it now that you've shown him how. Don't be surprised. Skiing isn't easy. Well, Rivet thinks it's hard. Maybe it is hard. Oh, where are you going? Charlie. Being on skis really isn't easy. Oh, look at Rivet go. He can ski. What's that? You're good at skiing too, Charlie Bear. Are you sure you can do what Rivet did, Charlie? What's that? Does it pull you up the slope? Be careful! Oh, even going up doesn't look easy. Good idea, Charlie. A few exercises before you set off. Yeah, stretch it out. Will you be going down soon? Oh, just a few more exercises. Can't be too careful. 
Is it time now? Easy. Okay, keep practicing before you try anything harder. Oh, don't go too far up, Charlie. Oh dear. Charlie, it's much steeper now. Charlie, be careful! <laughs> Did you mean to do that, Charlie? Charlie, I don't think I can watch you do that again. Are you sure you can do this, Charlie? Oh, Charlie. Charlie, watch out for that bump. Charlie? Charlie? <laughs> oh, Charlie. <laughs> Being a snowman is easier than skiing down a mountain, isn't it? <laughs> it's amazing what you can do with your imagination. So no more skiing then, Charlie. Oh, yes. Sledging is much easier. Bye-bye, little Charlie Bear. Bye-bye, everybody. Are you there, Charlie Bear? Charlie? Will you help me call him? Ready? Are you there, Charlie Bear? Is he out somewhere? Charlie? <laughs> oh, Charlie! <laughs> A pot plant, that looks nice. Oh, and another one. Charlie? What are the plants for? Oh, that's a strange way to walk. Do you need to go to the toilet, Charlie? Right, um... Looks like an elephant. So before you were a a gorilla. Oh, I know. You're a slithery snake. Elephants, gorillas, and snakes all live in the jungle. So that's what the plants are. Your jungle. Do you know what jungle animals like gorillas, elephants, and snakes sound like? <laughs> Are you going to find out what sounds they all make? That hat is definitely you, Charlie. Wow! A hot, steamy, tropical jungle. Let's go and find a... Oh! <laughs> Midge! <laughs> Where did you come from? Hiya. Um, you gonna... Good. 
I'm glad you won't be by yourself looking for animals in the jungle, Charlie. Oh, Niblet has come to join the Jungle Sounds expedition too. Excellent. <laughs> A real live jungle animal. What type of animal is it, I wonder? A gorilla! Yes, of course. That's how a gorilla sounds. A snake sounds too, Charlie. <laughs> wow! Don't be scared. It's only an <laughs> an elephant. See for yourselves. It won't hurt you. Maybe that's all the animals there are today. Maybe not. What animal could it be this time? I've never heard that sound before, Charlie. I have no idea what it is. Wait, wait, guys. Oh, it doesn't mean that it's a scary animal. Oh, dear. No need to hide in the dark. The jungle is a lot nicer than this cave. Charlie, Midge, Niblet, stop! It's okay, I'm sure it is. Ouch. You okay? I felt that. It's caramel! was Caramel making that noise? She was teasing you all along. <laughs> it's amazing what you can do with your imagination. Charlie, that sound was Frozo. You sat on him. Charlie? Oh, oh well. I think it's time to say bye-bye, little Charlie Bear. Charlie? Oh, Charlie! Bye-bye, <laughs> Charlie.